Hi guys, this is Miss Erig, and we're going to go over question number one um, on your circle review. Okay, so it tells us that EF and TU are um, diameters. So let's first, let's consider EF and how that might be able to help us. Here's EF. Now, because that's a diameter, we know that this is 57 degrees. So if you're one of my students, anytime we have central angles, I have you just fill out the chart immediately. So central angles... Um, we know that the angle and the arc is the same value. Um, if you remember from the Snapchat, you get to keep all the money. So that means if this is 57, this has to be 57. If this is 90, this has to be 90. Now we know that a straight line has 180 degrees. So to get this one, all I'm going to do is do 180 minus 57, which I'm going to do on my calculator off screen. And that gives me 123. So I know that not only is the angle 123, so is the arc. Um, now I have this other line. So here's my line going up and down here, TU, it tells us, is a diameter. We know that this is 123. So here we could just simply do 180 minus 123. And then, of course, it's going to get us 57. You hopefully notice that these two angles are vertical angles. So that's another reason why it's 57. Um, and then the other thing going this way, we have one more angle to figure out. All I'm going to do is do 180 minus 90, which is 90, and minus 57. Because if I subtract these parts right here and right here, it's going to give me what I need left. So 180 minus 90 minus 57 gives me this is going to be 33. Okay, and that means this is 33. Now I can pay attention to what I need. So the first question says, what's EU? Well, now that I've taken the time to already fill out my chart, I can say, oh, here's EU. Do -do 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 -do. What's EU? 123. All right, it says, what's SF? Well, I filled out my chart at the start of the problem. SF is 33. What's ET? Here's ET. Again, filled it out at the start. Now it's just really simple to figure everything out. Now it wants TFS. Ooh. So if we could just go this way, that would only give us TS. So we have to go all the way around. One way that you could do is add all those numbers up. I'm being lazy. I'm not. I'm just going to take my 360 degrees that's in a circle and subtract 90. And that's how I know it's going to be 270 degrees. SMU. I have a lot of writing going on. Let's see where's SMU. I don't see. Uh, oh, here it is. S M U is this. Well, clearly that's going to be a 90 degree angle. It's going to be a 90 degree angle because um, this angle right here is a right angle. So 180 minus the right angle, or I could have just added up um, those two values. EMS, and switch colors. Here's E, here's M, and here's S. So it wants this whole angle. Well, all I'm going to do is add that. So that's 147. All right, this is Miss Eric. Stay tuned for your next question. Bye, guys.